Thanks, my love. Drama, gossip, and all that jazz on E News tonight. There's a new cool event in town nowadays and it's live at the Elephant. It's basically a sort of concert that goes down on weekends presented by Eric and Sheba Wanaina, featuring hits this time around from Just a Band and performances by Miss Karen. <laughs> And DMX has cancelled his Kenyan tour after he and the Kenyan promoter failed to agree on his payment, though the fact that he has filed for bankruptcy might have something to it too. Apparently, he was meant to tour in Africa to make a musical comeback, but he was asking for too much. Oh well, it's probably a good thing because with his reputation, he would have probably ended up in prison before he was even meant to perform. So I guess all's really well. But Rihanna revealed a carnival side this week and in an absolutely ridiculous leotard, which I don't even know why it surprises us. Donning a sparkly leotard complete with a veil and face paint, the singer party the night away in her homeland of Barbados at the four-day morning jam party. Anyway, she's a much-needed two-month break from her tour until she then embarks for shows in Macau, Manila and Singapore. And Parenthood is going to be twice as nice from Megan Fox and hubby Brian Austin Green. Ten months after welcoming son Noah, Fox is now pregnant with a couple second child. Sources state that the actress and her husband are both very happy. We wish them well. But moving on, Kim Kardashian revealed a huge secret while on vacation with her family in Greece. She's moving to Paris. On Keeping Up With The Kardashians, Kim says she's heading to Europe when she delivers her baby. But is she even serious? Well, we guess only time will tell. And finally, Kesha says crazy things all the time. Some of them may be true, but all of them are just shameless stabs for attention. And here's the latest. Kesha claims she was born with a tail. For real. An actual piece of bone that was sticking out of her back. For some reason, this reminds me of when Lady Gaga was trying to convince everyone she had a male appendage. Anyway, Kesha says doctors removed the tail when she was born, which must have been where her talent was stored. And that's it from the world of entertainment. Remember, we do the dirty so you don't have to. I'm Rahila Dachia Sood.